Most of us can't go a day without feeling some kind of pain. Yeah, but that pain could be an indication that you may develop dementia later in life. A new study finds that people's pain levels increased at least a decade before the diagnosis. Week News Health and Medical reporter Veronica Marshall talked to one family living with dementia. Deb Job battled chronic pain for years, but leading up to her dementia diagnosis, it got worse. Probably would say five to seven years really kind of kicking in where I was really complaining about, you know, man, my, my arms, my hands hurt, you know, what's wrong? Um, getting more headaches. Than normal. New research says pain could be a warning. A newly published study followed more than 9,000 dementia free adults for 27 years. It found the people who developed dementia experienced increased levels of pain 16 years before their diagnosis. We know that there are several um, symptoms that appear progressively before dementia diagnosis. And uh, for example, they include change in mood or in behaviors. And uh, probably pain is part of these. Uh, these Symptoms. Job says if she had known about her condition earlier, it would have made all the difference for her family. We would have planned our retirement differently. We would have planned our budgets differently. We would have prioritized time together more. We would have looked into care options. But she still has hope that it can help yours. I want people that are in my position or find themselves in my position to have a fighting chance to catch it early to then be able to employ those strategies and be able to enjoy life, spend a little more time with their families. Veronica Marshall, Wink News Now. Now, researchers say next they want to try to narrow down the different types of pain associated with dementia. For example, is it all types of chronic pain or is the pain associated with dementia localized?